Internet 2.0 is all about the creation of content from individuals and I think that the property market is going to quickly catch up with uh, the democratization and more increased consumer power. That might be from a move away from traditional high street banks financing property deals to investors being able to invest small amounts in crowdfunded property deals all the way through to better information and review services on um, letting agencies, perhaps individual landlords, perhaps individual properties. So I think we're going to start to see a lot more um, content creation and engagements of individuals in the property space. Okay, so we're talking about the sharing economy here. We're talking about democratizing property investment. Are really small investors able to get involved on your platform? Absolutely. That's really important because what we're seeing is, that, is there are great deals out there by great people, found and executed by great people. Uh, so we can bring those together on a, onto a platform and then open that up to the crowd, to everyone, to any retail uh, lender. And when we say retail lender, that's everyone. That's you and I. That's, that's any, anyone that will lend from £500. And basically, that kind of means anyone with a savings account. And those savings accounts are probably getting 2%, which is lower than inflation at the moment. We're a people business because we bring together uh, people who want to live together, you know, whether that's a group of flatmates, one's moved out, need to replace them, or somebody wanting to rent out their spare room, you know. Um, and it's fascinating because the whole sharing economy, basically, it's been there for years. What we do is flat share. People who couldn't afford to rent a place on their own club together, rent it together, and they've been doing that for decades before the internet came along. Um, but it's such a great way of connecting people, just to use technology, to use communications, and bring people together in a much more meaningful way. Our relationship with the sharing economy is more of an uh, online voice and portal um, that as people are moving around the world or moving into a new neighborhood, um, we're sharing with them the um, basic needs and necessities and lifestyles that exist within a one, two, five or ten kilometer radius. Are you building an online community? Absolutely. We have Airbnb and most people are familiar with that. Uh, they associate that with uh, very short term rentals, maybe a day, two days, maybe a week. And then you have kind of where the property agents come in, which is over six months. So what you're filling is the gap in between. Exactly, exactly. The average stay on Airbnb is four nights. Our average stay is 30 nights, right? right. So we're filling exactly this gap. And we partner with 50 universities and companies who promote us to their students, to their alumni, to their employees, whoever has this need. And that's, that's basically what helps us grow in terms of building partnership and bringing customers. We are an aggregation service for long-term room rentals and flat shares. Uh, so obviously in a flat share you're sharing with other people. Um, that's generally how it works. That's how it works, yes. You're looking for flatmates and roommates and we provide an excellent product that allows you to quickly search the overall market. Um, and we are soon list, uh, launching a listing service so you can uh, list directly on our website as well. Okay, a little bit late to the party now. What's, what's different about what you guys um, do? I think we make it a hell of a lot easier. I think the process at the moment on all these, these sites isn't right. And I think it's difficult to find somewhere quickly. It's difficult to find the right people to live with. And it's obviously difficult to find the right price in the li right location. And we're hoping to make that a lot easier for you. I think this is a, this is a first step onto a, a much bigger product. Today's property sector is growing and evolving really rapidly. And today's been so exciting because of I've learnt from industry experts on how it's going to evolve and the future of housing and how we make our homes. I've enjoyed today, it's been a great opportunity to meet some really exciting people doing lots of interesting things in the prop tech space and we've been able to get some really valuable insights from a lot of the speakers. I really liked today because of the mixture of people that attended, uh, both from property backgrounds but also technological backgrounds. Uh, I enjoyed uh, today's event, Property Te uh, Prop Tech 14. Um, it was a great chance to uh, network with like-minded individuals and really learned a lot about the uh, property tech sector.